Hello, I'm Jacob Busby, and this is my comparison between the Hexno Monster Tires and the Ollie Originals. Let's get to it. So, starting off with the look of the actual tires on Ollie. So these are the blue uh, Ollie Original ones I got sent with my actual Ollie, and these feel, you know, a bit rub well, not rubbery, but a bit plasticky at the same time. And they have these circle things as the grip, if you get what I mean. Looking at the Hexno ones, you've got this sort of tire track, track to track, that kind of thing which adds more grip to it, which is quite good to see. So in terms of traction and grip sort of thing, so if you're out in the woods or somewhere a bit rocky or something like that, and you have these Ollie Original tyres on and you drive over, it'll be a very bumpy ride, trust me. If you've got these Hexnub ones on, you kind of roll over it pretty smooth compared to these. So if you're the kind of person who goes out in the wild with it, I'd take this. People will probably use Ollie inside on carpet and they'll say, why would I need good traction? But if you're in carpet, I'd recommend taking your tyres off completely and just drifting around like in my video I did. It's actually pretty fun. So in terms of putting them on and ease of access, that kind of thing. So if I start off with the Ollie tires, these are the original ones. Trying to put this on Ollie is actually quite a task. <clears throat> so there we go, there's Ollie's tire on. It does look a bit dodgy, I guess, but yeah, that was quite a hassle for me. You know, you have to stretch it quite far and you have to put quite a bit of force into it, which is quite annoying. Jumping over to the Hexa ones, these are more rubbery and stretchy. You can literally just slide them on, right, proper easy. Like that. And you're already on in seconds like that, you can slip it off really nice and easy. So, yeah, I think in terms of putting them on, Hexnub has to win. To finish off, I'm going to talk about the looks, then I'm going to go to overall view, that kind of thing. So, in terms of looking at them, if you saw them in a shop and you wanted to get which one, I'd probably go for the Hexnub ones because they look different. They look different and they make Ollie look bigger as an actual robot, which looks cool at the same time. I like it a lot. I prefer the Hexum tires. I use the Hexum tires. So, yeah. On about pricing, the Hexum tires cost $11.99 and the Ollie tires work out about £10. But I think Sphero charge for postage, so you are talking probably a bit more to get the Ollie ones. Anyway, if you want to see some videos of me using Ollie with the different tires, I do have a few I'll link in the description below. You'll be able to see how easy it is for me to drive, and I think it's a lot better to use the Hexnub ones, but that's just my opinion. Check out the description below to buy both these tyres and Ollie itself, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.